All right, guys, let's make some, let's make some homemade uh, DIY car coast, uh, coasters. So we're gonna go ahead and, I just took the flaps off of a box and I drew around this bottle on the bottom. This is felt material right here. So we're just going to cut around this. These scissors are not the best. I'm probably definitely gonna have to speed this part up. But yeah, you get the gist of it. You cut around. I'm just gonna make, you know how some car coasters have like a part that goes in? I'm just gonna make it completely circular. Um, because my uh, cup holders are pretty large, so they're not like tiny. Um, and this is actually bigger than the bottom of this and bigger than, you know, the bottom of my coffee mug. Or not coffee mug, but cup there. Um, so it should be like a good size. So we got one so far. And I like this color because it's um, pretty neutral, meaning it's not very, it's not super bright. Um, it's not the same color as the car cup holder. So it does have a little color to it. And at the same time, it's, so what I'm gonna do is, I think what I wanna do is, um, I have two pieces of felt. I didn't need both of them, it's okay. But I think what I wanna do is like cut this in half. So I'll take the piece of felt and I'll cut it in half like this. Right, and I'll use each half. Uh, it may not be like a perfect half because I don't even need the whole thing really, but I'll use each half to cover up the circle so the whole thing is covered. That's like my goal. I'm so excited for this. Um, so I think maybe I will just have a part on it. So I'll go like this, put it in the middle, put glue on it, and then cut around. So let's go ahead and take our glue gun, because that's what we're using. You know how like the glue kind of gets far down in there and you have to push down? So I'm just using a pencil to get the glue to come out. I think it's probably better to kind of go around the edges. I want you to be able to see it, so. Yeah, go around the edges so that it sticks well uh, to the fabric. Yeah, I know this is a messy edge job, but it's okay. All right, so then we're gonna put it uh, enough so we can just fold it over. Hopefully you can see this. I'll put it out here more. So we can fold it over like so. So, and then I'm gonna do the other side because I want both sides to be, to have some glue on it. And yeah, okay, so the pencil's still there. I want you to be able to see, I'm putting glue on both sides toward the edges. And I'm gonna close it off here so we have glue. And I'm just kind of pushing it toward the sides, right? Um, I think I also wanna put some glue like on the inside here so I can close it off. So I'll do that like off to the side here. So I'm putting glue on the edge, on the edges as well, on the sides where the fabric does not meet so that I can kind of like do this to it. Same thing with the other side, I can do this to it. And then what I'm gonna do is cut. Oh, this is turning out so beautiful. I don't know. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. I like it a lot. Oh wow. Okay, so there's our coaster. 
And then I'm gonna top it off with like a sunflower. So I'm gonna take this sunflower. I actually um, got this sunflower off of a pair of uh, a hair clip that I just never wore. So I like sunflowers and I just thought it would be beautiful. So there is our coaster. You can cut this a little bit more if you like. I think I will because it's not necessary. Um, it's a little bit much. It doesn't need to be present. But yeah, it does not have to be perfect either. It's just going to go in your... In the middle. Alright, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share if you care. Have a beautiful and blessed day. Goodbye for now.